I'm in the part of Seoul that's kind of like the uh, pet supply section of Seoul. This place here, out of all of the shops here, this was the only place that sold the Royal Canaan Siamese food, which my cats love. Um, they don't sell it anymore. They stopped. It's not that they're not just out of stock. They won't. Um, most of their customers apparently are, um, have Persian cats or kittens. That's what they sell. They sell kitten food and Persian, Royal Canaan Persian now. That's it. So. So there it is. I made a very long trip into Seoul to the one place. I came here because did I make a video? I'm not sure, but I came here uh, looking for a place that sold this stuff. And it took me all day to find that one place. That's why I came back here. Waste of, wasted trip into Seoul. I'm, I'm sick of living here. I'm, I'm just sick of living in Korea. Where you have to you have to travel for hours just to get the simplest little thing. And the reason I, I took I took the bag to my local pet shop. They they sympathetic, but I asked them if they could order it. No, they can't order it. I don't know why. I don't know Korean well enough to, to understand their explanation of why they can't order this 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 food for me because it exists in Korea. Some people do sell it. I know in Daejeon they sell it. But the local pet shops where I live um, cannot order it. And I don't know why. Uh, I don't know. I might, uh, I might send a strongly worded letter to the Royal Canaan Company, explain the situation. So maybe I don't have to take the train into Seoul on these useless trips to find things that they no longer sell because they are the worst business people in the world. Good Lord. How could you not keep something that you have sold? You don't have to buy a whole shelf of it, but for crying out loud, couldn't you keep one or two? because you obviously do sell them eventually. Oh. Back home. <laughs>